to many people, this is the classic view of the East Coast Main Line, a Gresley Pacific at speed. To Richard Willis, this was the end of an era, an era which he'd painstakingly recorded on 16mm cinefilm in the early 1960s, a record of a mainline railway that was as individual as its locomotives. 60051. Blink Bonnie was one of the last of her kind, the Gresley A3s, in regular service. She's seen on a rail tour that encompassed many parts of the East Coast Main Line, a mainline railway that had been built up in parts by the great Victorian engineers until the London and Northeastern Railway had amalgamated the whole into a main line without peer in the world. Gresley Pacifics dominated it from the inception of the LNER, a design of locomotive which had been inherited from the Great Northern Railway, which built the southern end of the line. Today, the only survivor of this great type of locomotive is popularly regarded as the most famous locomotive in the world, Flying Scotsman, an engine for which Richard Willis always had particular affection although he was unable to find it to film it until it was preserved. The A3s were developed into the A4s, Gresley's masterpiece, which were the fastest steam locomotive design of all. This is Bitten, the last survivor, and destined to be preserved. Our journey of remembrance commences at London King's Cross Station, headquarters of the LNER and the Great Northern before it, which had opened it on the 14th of October, 1852.